Hi Leo, this is your September forecast. If you'd like a private reading with me or hypnosis to facilitate permanent change, do use the link below. Look, this month your partner, your self-esteem and your salary uh, is um, what is going to be highlighted this month. It looks like there's a pause in funding uh, in your own salary or that of your partner. And uh, whether it be that you're waiting for funds, there's a delay there, or that you're unsure about what the future looks like. So Maybe they've said to you, look, we don't know what the future is going to hold. Maybe we need to shut down. Maybe, um, you know, the, the people who owe you money haven't been paying you. So there's that wait there to know what the future looks like. And there's not much you can do about that. For others, this is about, okay, I'm looking at what my future looks like financially or my career or my study. And so I'm going to stop and take the lay of the land. What is working right now? What isn't working right now? What can I do to better myself, to earn more money or to get that money in or for me to be able to, you know, study? What is it that I can do that will help me as a bridging gap, bridging loan or um, what is going to um, a highlight or... or um, benefit what I've already done what what is there going to be there now you Leo it's a, you're being asked to change the way you think change the way you're inspiring yourself and your mind your perspective uh, and and you're being asked to upskill get some more um, uh, abilities there uh, you're asking um, now to be able to look at the documents um, and to be able to have a lot of communication there but you are also having to commit to that. So this wishy-washy behavior, you know, this, this might be why you're in this pause. Uh, you know, it needs to have some grounding there. There needs to be firm guidelines and boundaries um, because whatever's happening in your career study in finance or with the, uh, it's just not stable. There is no direct and there is a pause there. Maybe you're deciding, look, I was going to do this, but the, you know, it, the plans have to be put aside for right now. When it comes to your home, again, we're looking at that commitment and someone isn't entirely uh, bringing it all home. So for example, your partners um, might be the breadwinner and the funds aren't coming in uh, because there's been a pause and uh, there's not enough money to pay the bills. Or one person's just spending up large, wanting to get everything done, and the other's like, ho, oh, wait down. We really need to, um, you know, slow our spending and uh, save for a rainy day in that area. The other side of this is that the, someone's taking some shortcuts, someone's not doing their full responsibilities here, um, and we're stuck on an issue here where somebody else is benefiting more than the other. Are we committing to our partner in a balanced way or is there some advantage uh, being uh, taken over the other? This card is saying uh, we want to lay down our roots. So for some of you, this is about committing to our home. Where you know this is the house we're going to stay in. No, we're going to stay where we are right now, and we're going to save up for um, you know because the plans where we were going to, but now we're not. We're going to stay. We're going to wait. So if we were buying a home, look, there's some sort of delay there, so we're going to have to stay where we are. We can't just pick up roots and move yet. Um, we just have to wait. Um, also, someone is someone here has very strong ideas about what the home and relationship looks like. So the uh, typical, um, you know, family unit or the typical how things need to be run. There needs to be some change here because it's a little bit offsided. When it comes to your health, look, we have to pull the plug and we have to start all over again. So, you know, maybe you've let things slide and you have to start all over again and you hadn't really been noticing that these things were happening. Uh, sixth house is... Solar plexus, midriff, bowels, colon, intestines, and abdomen. This is also healing oneself by practical, tangible ways. So if this is about too much stress, that we do need to start slowly and start again uh, to be able to move forward. And this is the time for you to be able to do that. Maybe you've let things slide here. When it comes to your love, if you're single, you're going to meet a Sagittarius, Aries, or a um, 
Leo this month and things are going to be really hot and heavy and things are going to move very quickly. Those of you that are in a committed relationship, look, your partner wants to go, go, go. Your partner wants uh, a lot of passion, so expect a lot of that this, this month. But again, we're looking at that commitment and who we're relying on. And, um, you know, maybe you don't feel like giving up that love because the person's not meeting your requirements in other areas and maybe you're feeling a bit touchy there because all month uh, your salary, your partnerships and your um, self-worth is being looked at under the microscope. So, you know, how is the situation making you feel not good enough? How is the situation and the planning and the research and the pause that you're doing giving you time to be able to look at how you feel about yourself and is this making things better? Maybe you're feeling more confident and able to put yourself out there. You've got to a certain part. For some of you, uh, money is tied to how you feel about yourself in that area and maybe you're feeling low this month. Um, we're starting at ground one again for some of you um, because someone's done some irresponsible behavior. They've moved in too quickly and now we have to stop and take stock of what it is that we're doing. We have got a loved one, a female uh, sister or um, parent, auntie, you know, uh, and this loved one's telling you that there is an addition to the family home. So maybe there are children coming. Um, maybe the process is long and slow. Uh, or maybe this, this, this. Um, if this is a pregnancy, maybe it's come as a bit of a shock, and that's why we're reassessing what everything looks like, and we've had to put things on hold. For others, this is family are coming home and into the home. Again, we've got that dream of children. So someone here, sun, moon, and rising, check it. Um, the idea of having children and that um, family home, um, it is now happening. So we have to commit to that and. You know, whatever this pause is and this responsibility and taking um, the other for granted and, and, you know, something here, there, um, we're looking at that. Someone might be a bit jealous about what's going on here and, you know, trying to bring you down from that. So be kind to you and those you love. And from Jedi side, Jack, may the force be with you.